Hi guys, I am Neha and once again I am back with a new video on our YouTube channel about technology. In this video tutorial, we will be discussing about primary and secondary memory in brief and also the differences between them. So let's proceed with the video. What is a memory? Well, memory is an information that you acquire from around the world, process it and store it in your mind so that it can be recalled later when required. Now what is computer memory? The computer memory is the storage of data or information that has to be processed and the instruction or code that are required to process this data. The computer memory is broadly classified into two types, primary memory and secondary memory. Let us discuss each of them in detail. Primary memory is the main memory of your system as it holds the data and instruction that are need to be processed currently. The primary memory is the internal memory, thus the processor or CPU is able to access this memory directly. Hence, it is accessed faster as compared to the secondary memory. The primary memory is volatile because as soon as the system power is off, the primary memory loses its data. It is made of semiconductor and hence it is comparatively expensive than secondary memory and present in limited amount in the system. The primary memory is further classified into two types, RAM that is random access memory and ROM that is read only memory. RAM is both read and write memory. It can be static or dynamic and of course RAM is a volatile memory. On other hand, ROM is read only memory. It is static, that is its content cannot be altered and it is a non-volatile memory. Now what is secondary memory? Secondary memory is also referred as auxiliary memory. As it is a secondary memory, it does not hold data that need to be processed currently. Instead, it holds the data that need to be stored for a long period. The processor cannot access secondary memory directly, so it needs I.O. channel to access secondary memory. The secondary memory is non-volatile and it does not lose its content even in the case of power failure. It is slower, less expensive and is present in bulk in the system. Knowing primary and secondary memory in detail, now let us discuss differences between them. Primary memory is known as main memory whereas secondary memory is known as auxiliary memory. CPU can directly access the primary memory of your system whereas CPU cannot directly access the secondary memory of your system. Primary memory holds the data that has to be executed currently whereas secondary memory holds the data that has to be stored for a long period. Primary memory is volatile in nature however secondary memory is non-volatile in nature. Primary memory is comparatively expensive to secondary memory. Accessing data from primary memory is quite faster however accessing data from secondary memory is comparatively slower. Primary memory is made up of semiconductor material whereas secondary memory is made up of magnetic or optical material. Primary memory is accessed through data bus. However, the secondary memory is accessed through I.O. channels. The primary memory is comparatively smaller in size. However, the secondary memory is comparatively larger in size. So this is all about primary memory, secondary memory and their differences. For more details, you can refer our official website techdifferences.com. I had given you URL for the same in the description below. Please like and share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel about technology. Keep checking the channel for further updates and put your comment and queries in the section below. We'll be back again soon with a new video. Till then, take a good care of yourself.